Hello and welcome back to my channel. I'm Joe Smoking Joe's Pit Barbecue. On today's video, I'm making up some of my favorite lunch meat, smoked bologna. Stay tuned. All right, let's get started on our bologna. This is a five pound chub of all beef uh, German bologna. Now I've smoked bologna before and I've tried to improve the recipe a couple of times. And on this recipe, I'm actually gonna start my Yoder Y640 pellet smoker at 150 degrees, just really low, really slow for probably two hours. And then after that point, I'm gonna crank the temperature up to 275 degrees and get the uh, outside nice and crispy. That 150 degrees is gonna introduce a, a lot of smoke to this bologna. And I gotta tell you, bologna by itself is really good, but smoke bologna, something special about it. So I'm gonna show you what I do to open this up a little bit as it cooks. Just make some cross hatches. I got a really sharp knife going in about inch and a half, maybe two inches deep. Just go around the entire log of bologna, just like this. Okay, just make lines. Again, trying to dig in about an inch and a half to two inches. Go all the way around. Real simple process. A good sharp knife helps. I'm using a cut knife, a cut chef's knife. And this sucker is sharp. Lines don't have to be perfect, okay? Just make sure that you uh, go in pretty deep here. The separation is probably an inch apart. I don't know if you guys can see that. Maybe the camera won't be picking up these, uh, these lines that I'm making here. Okay, they're not all going to be exactly perfect. All right, so I'm already back where I started. Actually, I'm going to give it a little one, just small cut here. Okay, at this point, I'm going to start in the other direction. Okay. And just do the same exact thing. And what this is going to do is as the bologna smokes, it's going to open up and give the um, outside edges a really nice kind of presentation, but also allows more smoke to penetrate the uh, bologna itself because this is a really dense uh, piece of meat. Okay, it's not like uh, porous, if you will. So doing this allows more smoke penetration, which is what we want. Now, the first time that I smoked bologna, I think I smoked it at a <clears throat> low temperature for a short period of time, and it was good. The second time, I increased the temperature, and that was really good. I smoked it a little bit longer, and I think it was an hour and a half, maybe two hours max, but this time, I'm gonna smoke it for probably three hours, okay? So I've, I've made the cross hatches. Not sure if you guys can see that on the camera or not. Okay. Next step, I've got some olive oil. Just a little bit, not too much. Just to wet the outside surface. Just like this. Because we're going to put some rub on this baby. Okay. Just like that. This is going to give something the, uh, the rub can stick to for sure. Okay, now the rub that I'm using is this bovine bo uh, bovine bold from Plowboys Barbecue. I've used this on several different uh, cuts of beef, and I love it. Okay, so this is going to be really good on this bologna, and just apply a good amount. In fact, I'm going to put it on the face here. Before I do that, I'm going to put some on the face, just like this. Okay, and then stand it up and then sprinkle it all the way around. Just go ahead and lean it like this. Put a good amount. Just like that. Just to where you can't see the bologna anymore. Okay. All right. I'm going to finish rubbing this down and we'll see you outside of the smoker. Stay tuned. All right, so we're outside of my Yoder Y640 pellet smoker. Now, one change that I did make is I mentioned I was gonna start the smoker at 150, and I liked the smoke that I was getting. You can see right there. 
at 180. I think I have more of a complete burn at 180 degrees. So I'm gonna start it at 180 for two hours and then one hour at 275. Now, one thing that I did wanna show you is I've already programmed my phone. Let me see if I can, you guys can see that. So I've got it set 180 for two hours and then 275 for one hour. So now that I got my bologna in there, I can hit start on the program and the cook starts. And the smoker will automatically run at one, uh, 180 for two hours and then 275 for one hour. As you can see there, the program has started and the smoker will do this all by itself. Okay, now I did have the door open so the temperature might come up a little bit, but 180 for two hours and then one hour at 275. So two different steps right there. So we'll see how it goes. I'll bring you guys back probably in two hours. I don't expect anything exciting to happen at two hours, but if it looks good, I'll bring you guys back. Stay tuned. All right, so we're two hours and 50 minutes into the cook and I haven't opened up my smoker whatsoever. Just a reminder that I did smoke the bologna for two hours at 180 degrees. Then I set the smoker via the app to run at 275 for one hour. So we're at, uh, again, two hours and 50 minutes. And let's take a look at the bologna. Oh yeah, looking really good. Nice and crusty there. It's looking really good, I'm liking it. So I'm gonna let it run for another 10 minutes and we will see you guys inside. Stay tuned. All right, I wanna bring you guys back for a minute. So we hit the three hour mark and I, I flipped the bologna so now the round part is towards the stack and I noticed that it's not as crispy on this side. So I'm gonna run it for an additional 20 minutes at 325 degrees just to get these, uh, this side and the round part of the bologna uh, nice and crusty like the uh, front of this uh, bologna did. So again, 325 for another 20 minutes. We'll see you guys inside, stay tuned. All right, so three hours and 20 minutes and this is what we got. I gotta tell you those extra 20 minutes did a number on this bologna. Now it's got a nice kind of red color. It's got some of the char on there. These pieces are going to be delicious. So let's, uh, let's cut a little piece off of this. I hate to cut something so beautiful, but we got to eat it, right? So I'm going to chop it right here. I got to tell you these end pieces right here are the absolute best. All this little crusty, see that? Those are the best pieces of the bologna. This is what we got. Let's give it a taste. All right, let's give this bologna a try. I gotta tell you the app, this is my first cook using the new controller. I just updated my smoker. The app was so easy to use and I learned something every time that I smoke bologna. Whether it's a brisket or bologna, I gotta tell you this is my third time that I smoke bologna and I learned something else again today. So. I'd like to smoke it at 180 for two hours. That's what gave it this nice red color. And then 275 for an additional hour. And then probably 20 minutes at 325. That is the money. Okay, so I saved the program on my phone. So next time I smoke bologna, I'm able to just pull up that, that program and run it. So let's give it a taste. Oh my goodness. Let me give some to my camera lady here. Man, good smoky flavor, a lot more than the other two bolognese that I smoked, but I think because of that 180, really layered some smoke on this bologna and it's got some amazing flavor. That rub is so good, really tasty. You know, you can make a sandwich out of this, maybe chop some up, throw in some eggs for breakfast. I'm gonna let this cool down and slice it up. We're gonna have some bologna sandwiches for dinner tonight. Thanks for watching. If this is your first time here, hit that subscribe button. Till next time, Joe Smoking Joe's Pit Barbecue. See ya.